Hi, I'm Vi Wickham, and this is a fiddle tune lesson on an old song called The Blackest Crow. Now, I say it's a song because it has words, and those words will be posted in the lesson notes below. Um, so uh, you may want to keep, find other versions that have the singing with it so you can sing along. Um, I have my violin crossed to it, right? <laughs> So I have A, D, A, D. So it's tuned in fourths. So something of note is when you cross tune your violin, it takes a little while for it to get in tune and it will adjust. It won't stay in tune uh, right off the bat. So I'm not using my normal violin to, uh, to play this tune on. I'm using a different violin um, that I just cross-tuned that I don't play normally. So um, again, the tuning is A, D, A, D that I play this tune in. I don't know that there's a standard tuning for this, but that's the tuning I do it in. Um, and it allows for easily playing it in two different octaves. So I can play it. So something else to note in cross-tuning your instrument is that when you have changed the tension on the strings, the intonation of that string will also vary a little bit. So, um, you know, where those notes are and where they're perfectly in tune is not exactly the same when you're cross-tuned as when you're not. And it's a micro-adjustment, it's a teeny-weeny adjustment, but it's an adjustment and so it's something to be aware of that changing your tuning, you know, is, will change where the notes are. It also changes the resonance of the instrument. So it kind of sounds cool. It allows for some some nice ringing, some sympathetic ringing of strings. So um, this is called the Blackest Crow. I'll play it for you, and then we will break it down.